This is a two, three, and four-way setup guide for the Nissan LZA500. First, ensure all units are on and initial settings are inputted on the master unit. Begin by pressing the menu button. Now press the up button until you see signal head. Master unit must be number one. Note, always remember to press the OK button after any changes have been made. Now press the up button until you see channel number and select a channel. Note, all units must be on the same channel. After the master is set to signal head one and the channel has been selected, Proceed to the slave units for setup. Please use the same instructions that you've just used for the master unit to set up each of the slave units. Number in the slave units as single head 2, 3 and 4 according to how many are required. And set all units to the same channel. When changes have been made, press the menu button to exit. Now back to the master unit to check the signal strength. Press the I button. Press up until you see connect quality. Note, the percentage needs to be at least 60%. If below 60%, select a different channel number on the master and all slave units. Then retest until a suitable channel has been found. Press the program button to start configuring your setup. Crossroads. Press the plus button for yes. Vehicle actuated. Press the plus button for yes. Note. This enables the radar for vehicle detection. Create program. Press OK. Pedestrian. Press minus for no. Note, a separate guide is available for setups with PEDS. Main signal headpiece. Select the number of heads being used and then press OK. Signal head one, green phase one. Press OK for each of the phases. Red time. Set the required time you wish the light to stay red between phases. Repeat for each phase ensuring you press OK to enter the time. Green time. Set minimum and maximum green time for each phase, pressing OK to enter the time. Note, if you increase the maximum green time, this will enable AMOS, Automatic man on site to add additional green time if vehicles are detected. Maximum green time can be up to 295 seconds. Save program. Press plus button for yes. Synchronization. Press plus button for yes. You should now see synchronization successful. Press the start button to begin the phases. Note, lights can be set up at the depot, disconnected for transport. Once on site and connected again, simply press the start button. The units will begin their phases. Always remember to disconnect batteries during transport to stop interference with setups en route.